Welcome back to Frontier Minecraft, folks. You're here with Lady Minecrafter and Minigun Mike. Hello. How's everyone doing today? <laughs> so, we're having some... Well, first, look what we found. Hello. I'm going to plug this up so that we don't get any unwelcome visitors. Oh, we need a torch now. Yes, we do. Thank you. Um, and... We're going to divide and conquer. We are having some microphone issues with Minigun Mike's microphone. He's having a lot of trouble hearing me today. And so um, we're going to do the best we can to work through that and work with it. And we just ask that you be patient with us um, as we try and work out those issues. Probably what we need to do is purchase a new mic a new headset for him. But at the moment, that's not a financial reality. So yes. um, not to get a good one anyway that's worth having. So we're going to divide and conquer. Minigun Mike's going to do some farming and some animal husbandry and some house building. He's going to build a house up here. And well, not in the why don't we sleep this lightning storm. Why don't we sleep this off? And I'm going to go caving um, and try and gather some resources so that we can start to build our frontier empire yes so to that end I've this is what I have I made myself a suit of armor um, I made myself a couple of iron tools I did splurge and take the arrows and make myself a bow because that can be the difference between surviving and not surviving when you're in a cave yep and I'm gonna uh, make myself some iron uh, armor also and uh, probably some iron tools and start to work on my farm so so I'm gonna head off I'll see you later honey boy this is backwards you're working on the house and I'm going mining yes well that's why you know we're so effective <laughs> we can both both do different things and <laughs> oh Oh, don't fall, woman. Yeah, don't, don't, you know, I'll come and rescue you, you know, if it gets too difficult for you. <laughs> I hear, I hear a skeleton. Oh, yeah? I do. Gonna give him a high five to the face? If I have to. You know, I'm, whatever it takes. I'm not looking for a battle, I'm looking for iron. Ah. Come on. Oh. Oh, I see darkness. Off to the dark side. Oh, I still have to make shoes. Forgot to make myself some shoes. So, last time I think you got lost in the mine, didn't you? Oh, probably. Oh, I fell down a hole. Yeah? Yeah. I have to say that one of my favorite things about Minecraft is the caving. I really love caving. Yes, you do. Um, I like the challenge. I like the exploration. I hear a skelly. Yeah? And I think I see him. Okay, I'm gonna sound like a total noob, but I'm having trouble making shoes. It's um four pieces, four pieces of iron. Uh huh. And it's in the low the um. If you're looking at a phone pad, it would be four and six, and seven and nine. Four and six, seven and nine. Okay, got it. Interesting. So. Yeah, it's Minecraft physics. Yeah. Oh. Uh, all right. 
And I need... So, and we have had some requests from one of our viewers to explain why we do certain things. Um, oh, yeah? It, what did we... Uh, what's the I request? think... I don't remember. Uh -oh. One of the questions <laughs> was that I filled... I think I filled in an area that was... Um, that I had just mined out, and he wondered why. Because oh, okay. he hasn't played Minecraft, and I wa I was I told him that one of the reasons I fill in areas is because if you leave a dark area, it will be very likely to spawn mobs. Yes. And that made some sense to him. Dead end. And I'm collecting mushrooms while I'm down here, because if we can find red mushrooms, we can make mushroom stew. And at the moment. We don't have a lot of food. No, we don't. And that's one of the reasons why I'm going out and doing a little... Doing the farming. Doing the farming, because somebody has to man up and do it, so, you know. Would you just man up for now? All right. Oh, hey, Skelly came to visit. Well, give him some tea. Okay. I should have made myself a... Um, oh, look, I left iron behind. You know, we're playing this on normal. Mm -hmm. Do you know if um, baby spiders are poisonous on normal? You know, I am not really sure. They might be. Um, you might just have to risk it. Creeper. So... Do, 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 do. Um, so once you get going, coal is a really common resource, and once you get going, you don't need to collect so much of it. Yep. But, hello, Mr. Creeper. Oh, you okay? Yeah, I'm okay. He exploded. He got too excited to see me. <laughs> There's a sheep down here. Like, I, way down. <laughs> yeah. I like, thought I had heard it. <laughs> <laughs> That's funny. Yeah. Like, I am pretty far down. Oh, yeah? Yeah. I'll tell you in a second what level I'm on. I'm on level 35. Wow. Yeah, I'm not... I mean, I'm not down at diamond level yet, but... I should have made a shovel. I got a shovel. Yeah, well, you're way up there. I know. So one of the things I'm trying to do up here is have all the wheat in one area, and then I'll have a carrot section and a... Um, oh, you know what else? What else? I should have made a bucket. Whoops. Should have made a bucket. Should have cut a water. I think I hear a spider. Yeah. A bucket is a useful tool to have when you're caving. If you come across um, lava, you can pour water over it. And you can... Um, that helps keep you from falling in the lava, which is a bad thing. I think I gotta go up there. And if you have a long ways to get down somewhere then you can use the bucket to uh, to do that you can put you can do a water drop which at some point I will show but not really any call to show it right now whoops fell underwater don't drown I won't I'll be okay hey just harvesting a little bit of wheat and... nope uh -huh. thought I'd found my way out <sighs> Oh, I did. I just went. I just made one wrong turn. Oh, I found my way back home, all by my lonesome. Wow, you didn't do an etho. No, I didn't. So, I'm gonna make myself a bucket and get so go get some water. I'm gonna and oh, and a shovel. Because I've been running into a lot of gravel. 
So you have a couple of different uh, series going right now. I do. Um, sorry, I'm concentrating on buckets and shovels. I have um, I have this. I have my Paradise series that I'm playing. I actually got a compliment. There's a guy, I'll give him a shout out. He's building his channel too. Conway, I think his YouTube channel is The Friendly Brit. Um, it's a nice name. He's he's a pretty nice guy. He's one of the guys I did Race for the Wool with uh -huh. when I when I did that Race for the Wool. Yep. So, um, and he's he's his YouTube channel is bigger than mine right now, but he's been doing it longer too. Right. So, um, oh, almost fell again. So. Yeah. Sorry, I was focused on a creeper. So he messaged me through the Skype and said that he had noticed that my channel was growing a little and that I was working really hard on it and developing it. And he and some friends of his are getting together to do some co-ops and some custom maps. And would I like to be included? And I was like, oh, that would be so awesome. Yeah, that sounds like a lot of fun. You know, and it's a really good opportunity for me. Ouch. This skeleton better at least drop the armor he's wearing. Yeah. Nope. None. And I'm down to one arrow. Ah! Uh-oh. Big fall. So I'm turning our old mud hut into a uh, barn slash workshop so that we have... Yeah, so I didn't finish talking about my series. Sorry, I got distracted oh. by the skeleton. <laughs> it's okay, I got and distracted the creepers. also. Um, so I do Paradise, which is the server that we all play on. The whole family plays there. And you get to see my different family members. Um, I don't know that you've done anything on Paradise. You've been in a couple of my videos, but we haven't actually done anything together. Yep. I think yeah. I've just had the girls, which is Glitched and Frostflame. And, um, and that's about it for now. Yeah, they, uh, I showed up in a episode where you were touring uh, um, the cliffside. Yeah. Homes. Oh. Well. And it is nighttime. And I have I can't sleep. No, it's okay. There's things I can do back at the house. Um. I got eight wheat out of the farm, and nice. planted a whole whole bunch more wheat, and I uh also got carrots growing and potatoes so I'm going to head back to our little apartment our flat our flat call um I hear a spidey he... I thought I heard one down here but I can't now he's gone so I'm not worried all right but I I'm way far away from you well not way far away from you but I'm not close enough that we would hear the same mobs. Right. So, um, and Nancy, uh, Nancy Frost and I are doing, mm -hmm. um, Emerald Dream, which is a map by Orange. I forget. There's four numbers. It's orange and four numbers. <laughs> Eat it, zombie. Eat my sword. <laughs> and uh, we've been having a lot of fun with that. It's hard. It's definitely outside our comfort zone of what we're used to doing. But we've been having a, a lot of fun with it. And we're getting better. We cried a lot last night when we played, when we filmed. 
We didn't cry. Did your, did your rage quit? No. But I did beg for a place to set my spawn because I kept dying and respawning at spawn. <laughs> uh-huh. And it's not very far, but <laughs> it was challenging because it was dark. Uh-huh. And we um kept having to run back and I was like, Really? <laughs> I don't want to run back again. So I'm going to have to apologize when I post that video in the comments, in the description, I mean, to the map maker who is watching some of the videos, which is cool. He's been in yeah. contact with us. It's kind of cool. I think it it's a he. I would assume. I don't know. I don't know. I made. I think I made that comment in the video that I didn't know if Orange was a man, if it was a boy or a girl, or a he or a she. However you want to put it. And maybe in the next comment that Orange makes, I'll find out. Yes, maybe. Maybe they'll tell me. Hmm. Oh, I can see your nameplate. Oh, yeah? Like, way, way up there. Oh, okay. You're, like, really far away. Well, what level are you on? 34. And I am on 61. Yeah. So. And I could only see it, I think, because I was, um, Because I was in the dark. <laughs> like, because I was in a dark spot, and you can, the, the nameplates show up more easily like, in the dark. Right. I know when I've watched, like, ultra hardcores and stuff, if they're looking for people, they'll bury themselves in a hole for a minute and look around. Oh, really? Yeah. Ultra hardcore would be kind of fun, but you definitely need a group. You know, and it's tough. You have to be prepared to lose. Yeah. Just, it's hard. Hey, we have a double stack oven now. Cool. So, um, and what are you doing with Glitch? Um, we're not doing any personal series, just the two of us. Okay. Ooh, I found a r ravine. And a skelly. And I have three arrows. And a broken bow. Three arrows and what? I apparently collected a broken bow. Oh. Interesting. From a skeleton that I killed. Whoops. Where does this water come out? Oh my gosh, it's way up there. I won't be shutting that off. No? No, it's like... So what are you seeing down there? Oh. Um, just a lot of cave. It's ki I'm kind of in a ravine. There's a ravine under us. Uh huh. I'm kind of hoping that maybe I'll come across an abandoned mine shaft because they're really good for resources. I'm trying to shut this water off. <laughs> Oh yeah. It makes it easier to travel because the water kind of pushes you along and gets in your way. Um 
And if anybody who's watching wonders why I'm not going down, it's because I want to, like, this is a really good level to find iron at. And right now, iron is our prime, is one of our primary needs. I saw some in the ceiling here on the way in. Um, so I'm just trying to be a good resource gatherer here. Resource hog. Resource hog. I'm a whore for iron, I admit it. I can't walk away from it. You're what? I'm a whore for iron. The, uh, <laughs> <laughs> the um, one of the things, I watch a lot of uh, Vintage Beef, and he does Abba Rules Caving. Ah, uh, what's that? It's, um, he made it up. And it's oh, really? where, yeah, it's his invention. And it's where, um, you go caving with someone else. Uh-huh. And he ma it's named after some song that Ab Abba did. Uh, the okay. band Abba. Uh-huh. And whatever re like certain things have certain point values. I forget I don't know the rules the rules, the point value rules. But whoever has the most points um gets everything. So like if you and I went even if you collected a lot of stuff, if I had more points because diamonds are worth more. Oh, there's lava down there. Whew, right <laughs> underneath me. Um, Distracted by the shiny things again. Then I would win and I would get everything uh -huh. that we collected, that you collected. I found lapis. Oh, sweet. I know I that's your that. favorite. I know, and I you know, I don't have much okay. use for it. Um, so here's how I would use water in this case. See, it put out some of that lava. It covered it. And now I can jump down with relative impunity. Um... And so, iron, because it's so common, does not get points. Iron and coal. And I can walk past coal. I don't have so much of a problem with that. But boy, when they walk past the iron, I'm thinking, how, how do you walk past that? Yeah, iron's so useful. Well, but they have, they have it. I mean, it's, they don't really need it, you know? Yeah. So, so, it is daytime again, and is it, you yeah. know what, Ooh, you know what, creeper. you know what time it is? N nope. Time for, time for us to take a break. Oh, it is. It, it is. It's time for another episode, for the end of the episode. All right. So, I'm going to let you leave me here caving, and, right. um. And we'll see y'all next time. See y'all next time. Never stop Minecrafting. It's too much fun. Yes, it is. And we're back. Welcome back to Frontier Minecraft. We yes, got welcome back. Lady Minecrafter and, and Minigun Mike. Mike. And I'm going to try and get this, even though it's really dangerous, I'm going to try and get this iron because it's so hard for me to walk away from iron. I mean, it's so useful, and really, we're so resource poor right now. Yeah. You know, we really need way more resources. I hear a zombie. Oh, yeah? I just killed a spidey. Oh, there he is. And my sword is in the wrong spot. Let me keep my head on a swivel and make sure that I, uh... I know. Don't get snuck up on, even though it's daytime. Uh, to, it just turned day, and I need to make sure that I'm not attacked. Yeah, it's important. My viewers who saw me collect that red stuff, and they don't know what it is, because I, I know that I have some viewers who haven't played the game or haven't played too much. Um, that was redstone, and redstone is used like the electricity in the game. It, it's a power source, so I wonder where that zombie noise is coming from. Um, Badge calls them zombles. Zombles? Mm -hmm. Really? 
That's funny. Yeah, it's cute. He does some really good... That's another Minecrafter, another Minecracker, who I watch. I watch primarily Minecrackers. They put out really high-quality videos, and, um... Ooh, hello, Creeper. Ugh, oh, thanks a lot. <laughs> What'd he do to you? He blew up. Oh, that's no good. Um... They put out good quality videos, and, uh -huh. you know, I just, I like their videos. Yeah. So, and you can't watch everyone. You just can't. So, that's basically what it comes down to is you watch the ones you like, and they're who I like. Um, but one of them, he's not new on the server. He's been on as long as Vintage Beef. But he doesn't have as many subscribers. He does not do it for work, I don't believe. I could be wrong. Oh, hello! Um, but he, he really has a good understanding of the game. Who's the that? Badge, W92 Badge. Oh, okay. And, um... You know... He gives some really good tutorial lessons on how to on the mechanics of the game, and so you know if you're oh gold, if you're looking for some game information, he's he's a good guy to go to, and he deserves he does he's an amazing builder. I uh, they've done some patch downloads of some of the places in that in on the Minecraft server, and I really kind of wish they would do some patch downloads of his his builds because I'd love to check them out. Yeah. Yeah. Um, wasn't he the one who did the patch download that you and I saw? The patch download. Um, where they were talking about the 1.5 update and some of the things you could do. Mm, I don't think so. Okay. Who was that that we were watching that time? I don't know. Oh, okay. I don't remember that. It, well, it was when we saw the quartz. Mm, I, he doesn't do snapshots. Was it Doc M? Oh, yeah, it was Doc M that we were watching that time. Doc M does pat does update. That was pretty cool. I'm definitely looking forward to the quartz. The quartz, I am too. I'm going to actually use it in my um my shooting gallery. Oh, yeah? Yeah, I've decided, you know, I have that horrible... Have you been on Paradise? I haven't been on to Paradise in quite a while. Um, I have a, I have that big tower, and the way I did the stairs, uh -huh. there's a horrible drop in the middle. And people keep dying. <laughs> Whoops. <laughs> Which is funny, but not funny. Yeah. Um, because I want them to die on the games, not <laughs> getting to them. <laughs> So, um, I've decided what I'm going to put in the middle. It's going to be a surprise. If you want to oh. see it... Like, Are you going to tell me, or is it going to be a surprise for me also? No, I'll tell you, but not on camera. Oh, okay. You're so sweet. Um, I tried to tell you this morning, but we kept talking about other stuff. Yeah. All good stuff. Yeah, all oh. good stuff. But we had some pretty serious conversations going on this morning. Yes, yes we did. So, um, oh, you okay? Yeah, I d didn't. I thought I'd picked my water back up, and I didn't. Oh. Okay, we have quite a lovely little farm going on here, and I'm gonna start building. Oh, you know what I forgot to do? I was well. It was nighttime. I went into the flat and um, built some fence, and uh, I forgot to make. Uh, gates. So now I have to do that because no sense in making a fenced-in area if you don't have a gate to get in and out of. You know what I mean? Oh, what's wrong? I'm getting attacked by a skeleton, and I can't. My sword broke. Oh yeah. Do you have an extra one with you? 
Yeah, but I had to equip it. My sword didn't break. Where was it? Oh, it switched. That's annoying. Oh. And, like, my water... I put my water down in an effort to... Like, I made a mess. Yeah. Well, that's not good. So. It's okay. We survived. Good. So how are you doing resource-wise? I have um, 57 iron ore, 6 gold, 56 redstone, 2 stacks plus of coal. I'd love to find some diamond, but um, diamonds are rare. Yes, they are. I th although I've done pretty good on diamonds on Paradise. Yeah. I mean, we have... We're loaded on Paradise. Hmm. Too bad we're not loaded for real. <laughs> you know? Yep. But it's not all about stuff, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls. It was interesting what uh, Klitsch was talking about the other day with the book. Um, yeah. Five Children in a Knit. And her under understanding of the book. It was. I was really impressed with that. Um, Glitch is our 12-year-old daughter. And she's doing a book. We homeschool. And she's doing, leading a book discussion at a co-op that we attend. And one of the things that she's pointing out in her book discussion is that the kids get to wish for stuff in the in the book and what they wish for is to have riches and they end up realizing that it's more of a burden than a blessing and she said isn't that like real life and i thought that's for a little girl that's that's a deep deep realization yes it's easy when you're young to... I'm not sure I would have thought that way at her age. I don't think I would have either. Yeah. It's easy to think money will fix everything. Money just pays the bills. Yesterday, we have a new guy on the server. Um, and he popped on, and he had said he was having trouble, like, surviving the mobs. Mm -hmm. Or I had seen that in a post that he posted to me right and so I went I took some of the broken armor we had and I took a little bit of iron and I left it in a chest for because we've proved a couple of new members uh-huh and I told him when he logged on I said there's stuff in a chest that spawned for you because you said you were having trouble and he goes are you sure it's okay for me to take this I said yeah it's there that's what it's for he said, well, this is really high-end stuff. I said, what's high-end about it? He's like, it's iron. I'm like, it's just fake stuff. <laughs> right, yeah. It didn't actually cost me anything. <laughs> yeah, and I was like, it's my stuff. I want to give it away. It's mine to give away. He's like, all right, well, thank you very much. And for those of you that are wondering why I did that um, the way I did, I'm going to die in a fire here. Um, Please don't die. Because if you put water down, ooh, diamond, and you, um, you mine underneath it, then when the, if the water hits the diamond, the, when the water hits the lava, if you mine down into lava, then the water, I'm sorry, I'm distracted by diamonds. You, the water hits the lava, then it will immediately turn to obsidian and it won't burn up the stuff that you're mining which is very helpful when you want what you're mining if you don't want what you're mining just let it fall into the lava it won't yeah. matter diamond 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 diamonds Ooh. there's a spider on top of the uh, mud hut that's tracking me and every once in a while it glitches through the ceiling and it's kind of funny <laughs> if you 
If you're in the mud hut, you can take, they can't go through a one wide area. Right. Only the baby spiders can. Uh-huh. And, um, oops, I'm having more trouble putting and picking up this water. And you can just take out one block and kill him. Oh. You know, above you. Right. So, this blue... Oops, that's not what I wanted to do. This blue is diamond, to my viewers who don't know. Wow. And the first thing you want to do is this. You want to be sure that there's no lava under it. You like how I make a shovel and then I dig with dirt? Nice. He's, uh, the spider is... Only two. Cannot seem to get him. So actually, you had talked about going over to Badge's channel because he's got the tutorial on how to get villagers to stay and what makes a house a house. Yeah. And um, you were going to check out what he had to say. And he's really got that technical stuff down. Like, he has a good understanding of it. Um, it impresses me. Yeah, I really like being able to go and watch uh, people like that where they can really explain how to do something. Mm hmm Yeah, and you can go to the, the wikis. Oh, there's no place to go here. You oh, but to there's excuse gold me. in the ceiling. Drinking some coffee. I, uh, I got a bit of a cough today and trying not to cough into the... Uh, um, into the microphone. <laughs> oh. So, um, we've been told we're too serious. Stop being so serious. Stop being so serious. So, so what I'm going to do then is I'm going to start telling jokes. Okay, I'm going to get burned by lava. And I'm going to fight a, um, the spider once and for all and collect his drops. All right, so uh, two Irishmen walk into a bar. And, oh wait, that's not a joke. That's a family reunion. Nice. <laughs> nice. That's not racist. <clears throat> oh, it's not racist at all. Oh, um, sh sugar plum fairies. Oh, somebody was going to say naughty words. No, I wasn't going to say it, but I was hey. thinking it. A a zombie villager. Ooh, and a creeper. Doing a little mob hunting while I'm out. You know, it's nighttime. I'm getting a little bored. I lost my water. What is it about that spot? The creeper. Creepers keep blowing up that same hole. It's kind of uh, amusing. Up. Up, woman. So, well, on that note, I think maybe we'll do a little extra because we're caving today. Yeah. So, um, uh, if our viewers have anything they want us to show them or talk about while we're on, we'd certainly enjoy hearing from them. Yes, we would. Um, and some of, you know... Yeah, we're a little serious, but some of it is just simply the concentration of getting through uh, whatever it is we're working on at the time. Yeah, it takes and practice to learn how to work and talk. It does, and we're kind of new at this. And Are you calling me a noob? Um, when it comes to recording, yes, you're definitely a rookie. A rookie. Yes, rookie. Speaking so. of rookies... 
Oh, well, yeah? We're recording this on Saturday. Uh-huh. And the Super Bowl is tomorrow. Yes. Are we allowed to say Super Bowl? Yes, we're, we're allowed to say <laughs> Super Bowl. It's the Har Bowl. Yes. That's what they're calling it. Did you know that I was reading this on uh, the ESPN about um, there was a guy um, like last year who figured out that because of uh, where uh, the two Harbaugh brothers were coaching that it was possible for them to play each other in the Super Bowl. And so he went and applied for a copyright for Har- Harbaugh Bowl. And, Har Bowl? Yeah, and something else. And when the NFL got wind of it, I guess they were like, hey, you can't you know, you need to withdraw this, and uh, he's like, hey, you know, I'll tell you what, you know, wh- I'm a big Colts fan, what do you say, you let me, uh, you know, can I get uh, season tickets, or can I meet a couple of the players, or something like that, and they're like, no, you need to just not do this, and they were threatening to sue him, and he was like, okay, I don't really have the financial resources to to sue um, the NFL? Yeah, he had to defend myself against them, so I guess it's going to be they win. So I, I thought that was kind of um, lousy of the NFL to do that. You know, I mean, he was the first one to think of it, you know. And what the, was their reasoning? Why couldn't he? I, I don't know, because they never went and did the copyright themselves. They just let it well, yeah. hang, hang out there and... My feeling is, why not? Why not support your fans? You know, I mean, how great would it be if if they were like, hey, you know something? Instead, um, what would you say? You know, if they do make it, you get to go. You know, let them go to the Super Bowl. Let them meet. Let them meet the brothers. You know. Yeah. And um, I don't know. It just it was really. I hate when big organizations behave like that. Um, because here was a chance to have some goodwill with the fans and really improve upon things, and instead they decided to just be idiots about it. <laughs> Say what you really mean, honey. You know, I'm going to use all those big technical terms, you know, that I learned in business Ooh. school. So Down in a hole. Down in a hole. Um, so who do you think is going to win? Um, I think that the Baltimore Ravens are going to win. Um, and they're very hungry right now for a win. And, um, I think that they have a, uh, I think they have more experienced players. And I think that, um, their quarterback, I can't think of his name right now, um, Flacco. I think Flacco's got a little bit more experience in the big game and in pressure situations than um, the uh, quarterback from San Francisco. Mm-hmm. So we will just have to see. Who? What do you think? I, I don't know enough about either of them to say. <laughs> They're not teams that I follow. Yeah. So, um, so I can't find my way out. I don't know how I got down here. Good job, Ace. Oh, it's not the end of the world. I'll find eventually. There's not. It's not that big a place. Like. Yeah. Oh, I think no. This is the place I just dug up. Well, there's a way up. We'll see. We'll see where that goes. I've been there before, so. Yeah. Yeah, this is where I came in. Um. I think you know Ray Lewis is a really great guy. Uh huh. And he he knows the truth about the world. He's a committed Christian. Um, he's a good you know he's he's a good person. Right. There's a lot of controversy from when he was uh, early in the NFL, and there's people who are making issue with it and uh, like you stuff know. that he did. Yeah, just he he was involved in a incident. Um, either his um, rookie year or 
you know, or very early in his career, and um, he was with some people, and uh, someone ended up dying, and uh, oh, really? Gets, gets stabbed, yeah. And um, there's a lot of controversy about that. Um, and we were talking about it at work the other day, and uh, you know, my feeling is he went through the justice system, and the justice system did what it did and you know if he's improved on his life and and made amends for for things well good for him you know uh yeah but here's the thing has everybody forgiven michael vick no they haven't and um roethlisberger yeah oh definitely not you know i mean there's you know i mean people are going to make mistakes just because they're famous doesn't right. mean they don't make mistakes and things don't happen. Yep. And I think, you know, well, this is What's a wrong? deep ra- this is a deep ravine. And I have to figure out how to get back up to where you are cuz I have no idea. Hmm. I may end up just digging up Oh yeah, yeah. Um, she doesn't help you move forward. So, but this is his retirement year. This is it. He's done. Right. And it would be nice for him to leave with a Super Bowl under his belt, Super Bowl win under his belt, you know, and yeah, have that I think, memory. I think he's got one right now. Oh gosh! Hello, okay? Mister Zombie. Yeah, I just had a zombie drop down on me. Like. <laughs> <laughs> that was no. you just wanted to say hi see how you're doing ask you a few questions probably just looking for directions yeah you know it's the creeper trying to move, make it along in this world you know it's a it's a big scary world out oh gosh there. don't are you getting beat up are you getting mugged pretty much it's my own fault I pillared up and right. I was on a it's my own fault. I asked for it. So. So, on that note, I think we're going to call it a day. And we're going to tell you, see you next time. See you next time. Never stop Minecrafting. It's too much fun. Oh, yes, it is. And we're back. You're here yes, with. we're back. You're here in Frontierland with Lady Minecrafter and Minigun Mike. Say hello. And I wish I had a minigun. And you wish you had a minigun. I wish I knew how I'd gotten into this cave system. But I don't. <sighs> <laughs> and there's still, like, I still haven't collected. I haven't filled my inventory. I have a stack and a half of iron. I have two diamonds. I have 23 lapis, which are pretty useless. 13 gold. Two stacks of redstone. Two and a half stacks of coal. Seven zombie flesh. I have one arrow. I could sure use some more arrows. Um, but my pick is almost dead. See that? And the only thing I have left besides that is a half dead, or mostly dead stone pick. So I have some wood. I'm going to make myself a crafting table, which is that. I'm going to plunk it down over here. There we go. I'm going to use some of this coal to make an oven. It's not coal. It's cobble. Uh-huh. <laughs> and I'm going to smelt some of this iron so that I can make myself another pick. And while I wait for that, I'm going to try not to wander too far. But I am going to collect this water. And I'm really wishing that I could... um. That I could find a dungeon. That would be yeah. cool. To show our viewers a dungeon. Dungeons are cool. I'm uh I built a uh a little pen and I'm off in search of cows. Moo cows. Ooh. Oh. When I was in uh oh, the boys pick just died. Oh. When I was in the Boy Scouts at uh Boy Scout camp, 
uh, anytime we had, um, we'd be sitting around the table and uh, somebody would finish the carton of milk, we would lay the carton down and say, uh, dead cow or dead moo or so imagine a bunch of 12 year old boys doing that it was pretty amusing at least we thought we were amusing <laughs> oof spider I should probably make myself another sword while I'm at it come on Mr. Cow you want to come get locked up are you sure he does yes I'm sure well he wants the wheat down oh gosh open. I have got to fix, fix my inventory because, like, one of the things I do is I always keep my sword in my number four slot so that if I suddenly need my sword, I can, and I can't rotate, I can't trust this mouse wheel. It rotates too quickly. Yeah. And so if I suddenly need to get my sword equipped, I can just hit 4 on the hotbar and use the hotkey. Right? Oh, yep. And um, it's in the 3 slot, so I keep selecting the bow. It's in the what slot? Three I slot? My sword was in my 3 slot. Not oh. my 4 slot. Uh-huh. That's not what I wanted to do. I wanted to see. That's enough iron. We'll pick up the oven. We'll make two more picks. Well, so we never... for Minecraft basics, after you punch a tree, you take a log, you put it in your crafting bench like this, or you can do it in your head, you pick it up, and then to make sticks, you do that. So that's the Minecraft basics. I'm going to make two more picks. I'm going to throw away that stone pick. And then I'm going to make a sword. Um, and I'll throw away the spider eye, even though I love them. <laughs> so, and I'll take the rest of this, the rest of this, these sticks, and I'll make torches with them. And I'm still picking up, I got a, um, Come on, woman, speak. Ah, uh, I gotta pick up the crafting bench. <laughs> so, because I don't want to leave that behind, it's valuable. So I have a choice. I can go this way, which looks very promising. Ooh, oh, don't fall, woman. Oh my gosh. Or, I can go that way which also looks very promising. In the mini I bet they... Oh, there's a creeper this way. And he's coming to get me. He's coming to get you! He's coming to get you! And he blew up. And another one. Oh, Mr. Creeper. Stop blowing up my torches. <sighs> Stupid creeper. Are you okay? Yeah, I'm okay. He didn't hurt me, but he just made a mess of the uh, world around him. So, it's... I got him with the sword and knocked him back and he decided to, to commit suicide anyway. I need to eat. Well then, eat! Did you forget how to cook? No. No, I have food. I just... You're getting distracted again. Distracted, I tell you. Yeah. Look at all the arrows in me. Huh. So, you can also repair items by putting them together. We call this the crafting block in your head. I don't know what it's actually called, but... That's what we call it. Um, that's a good name for it. The crafting block in your head. I'm going to switch my sword out with the one that's 
in good shape. Um, so this is a lot of fun. This like I'd forgotten how much fun it could be to just play survival. Yeah. <sighs> um, this mouse wheel is so unreliable. Why? It because either it moves not at all, or it'll move five slots. Oh. Or, you know. Yeah. And you're like, really? <laughs> Ow. You know, I probably have a shovel and I don't really need it. No, I don't have a shovel. Interesting. I'm usually pretty good about making shovels. I'm, uh... It's nighttime and I'm out at night. Uh... And I'm trying to repair the damage that the creeper did. Stupid Ooh. creepers. Cheaty skelly creeps. left arrows. I hear lava. Lava, 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 lava. Oh. All right, Spidey, you want a battle? Come on, buddy. Oh. Ah, oh, get my butt kicked by a spider. No. Ah. Oh. You okay? Stupid. Fiddly. Really? Did you die? No, I didn't die. Stupid creeper blew up half the uh, mud hut. I was fighting a spider and the creeper jumped down. And... Uh, uh, I think I'm going to have to... Take my uh, sword to your face, Skelly. Yeah. So I'm spending all this time making repairs instead of doing what I need to do. What I should do is just go back inside. Um, is it lit up out there? It is where I am. They're coming in from the shadows. I think I need to light up more. Or put fencing. Yeah, well, I'm trying to work on that. I've got the first cow. Oh, I'm being attacked by a spider. Ooh, I think I need to go back in. I'm almost about to die. Don't die. Well, I, uh... I was doing all that mob fighting and I had gotten hungry and I didn't realize that I was uh, so hungry or that I'm having trouble speaking right now walking and talking it's a difficult task um, <laughs> I uh, I had gotten hungry and I was down on hearts and I wasn't recovering and so uh. And I almost swore. I I noticed that. I was doing the best I could to try and fight oh my. Mod Hut. And I kept getting jumped. Um, uh, well, I'm in the flat. I went back to the flat. I'm going to make an iron sword. Maybe I'll... So that's an example of a water drop didn't give me very much. Oh. So what are you going on down there? Um... I just, oh, just still looking around the caves, looking around. I have no idea where I am in relation to you anymore. Oh yeah. Yeah. But what's your uh, what are your coordinates? Oh, I have no idea. Well, I'm at uh, positive twenty six two fourteen. 
Oh, I'm not too far from you. I'm at 25,324. Oh, okay. Yeah, you're not very far. What's your, uh... My Y is 47. Oh, okay, yeah. So. Yeah, so if I went... Like, if I had to get out of here fast, I could, um, just dig straight up. And maybe I'll do that to show the viewers who would like to know what that would look like. You know, give them an example of that. Now yeah. this is Minecraft mechanics. You put a torch in where the water comes out and it stops. <laughs> Nobody says it makes sense. I'm gonna run back here into the light and I'm gonna make some more torches. Um, one, two, one, two, one, two, one, two, one, two, well, one, two. If you make 16, you turn oh, two logs into eight planks, and uh -huh. that makes 16 sticks, and then you make, um, you make torches with that, and you get exactly 64, which is one stack. And then you don't have, like, extra torches in your inventory. Oh. Like, you only have one inventory spot given up to torches. Right. That is one thing I am not good at. Um, the whole math of... Uh, You know, if you start with two logs, you end up with whatever. I don't don't do the calculations well. Uh, I guess I just haven't played as much. So. What are you saying? I play a lot. Well, you know, you do. Uh, you do get your fair share, sweetie. You know, but I'm sure that you can quit at any time, you know. Oh, totally. I'm sure you're not addicted. You know, you just got to get well every once in a while. <laughs> you know, half our viewers probably don't even know what that means. No, they probably don't. But it may be a good thing. Just trying to get well. Oh, time to repair the barn. Another Minecracker that I don't watch but I see in videos is Anders L. He's Swedish and he's described as having no filter and it's true he has no filter. If you're going to be offended easily you cannot watch Anders L. <laughs> um, but <laughs> he is funny. Uh -huh. he, made a, he made a comment that I will choose not to repeat because I'm a lady. And yes you even, are. Even Beef was like, yeah, my viewers don't need to know that, Anders. <laughs> that was pretty funny. Yeah. And, um... I hear a zombie. But... Yeah. But I do see him in, um... Other people. When he plays with other people, I see him. And, you know... He's not a kid. He's a young man. But yeah. you just got to kind of take people. This is, it's video gaming and you're going to run into people that don't think and talk like you do. And unless you're a kid and your parents are worried about exposing you to, you know, stuff that you're not really mature enough to handle. Dude. Yes. A creeper, two zombies, and a skeleton. Sounds like a party. Two ske two two creepers. One get, creeper. Get the Doritos. No creepers. Did the creeper blow himself up? Oh. Yes. He always spoils the parties. You know, everyone's just hanging out, having a good time, listening to the jukebox, little stall. Oh, I love the jukebox. And Along comes Mr. Creeper going, hey guys, look at me, check this out. And next thing you know, he's ruined the party. And it is just... 
they really oh gosh, they need to I learn to go. control themselves. You know, they they always say, "I just want to hug, man," and it's not true. They don't want to just hug. They want all just they want your attention. <laughs> attention hugs. Yeah, bunch of babies. Mmm. <sighs> So I'm doing a little terraforming so that I can repair all the creeper damage. So that I can go back to building pens. Although our farm is coming along quite nicely. If you get a chance, you should come out and check it out. Yeah, I'm thinking maybe I'm going to come out soon. Oh, that, that creeper, ha that creeper, that skelly has an enchanted bow. Yeah, you're going to go whack him? Mug him for his bow? I can't get to him. He does a lot of damage, though. Oh, yeah? I gotta heal up. One of the problems, like, if he does drop it, he may not necessarily... Um, it may be just about out. Yeah. And if you, even if you do a repair to it, it's not gonna... Um, so, yeah, yeah, no, no, if you repair it, you have to repair it on an anvil to keep the enchantment. Um, to my, oh, I'm out of arrows, darn it! Cheaty. Wow! Dude! Yes? I don't think I can beat him. Really? I'm out of arrows. You can't just punch him in the face? Well, if I get there and get in his face, I can't get back because he's in water. Oh. And that's what I was going to tell my viewers. Plus, there's a creeper right there. Right there. Um. And I'm down to three hearts. Three hearts? Um. The mobs cannot fight the water current. So I left the water there so that they would um, not be able to come and get me. That's what kept me safe during that melee. So, oh wow, another zombie. I don't yeah. know if I'm ready for a zombie. He's got a golden helmet on. That he didn't drop. Big jerk. <laughs> so, maybe on one of these episodes we should uh, go out and do a little exploring. I think that would be a marvelous idea. Yeah. And if there's something the viewers would like to see, they can certainly leave a comment and let us know. So, just gathering more dirt. I'm a dirt farmer. You're a dirt farmer. Really? Really. No fool, and there I was, being a dirt farmer, and uh, along came a cheaty creeper and he uh, ruined my dirt farm oh lag lag so now I think I'm at the bottom of the ravine again oh yeah? yeah level 24 I might look around here a little more and then dig myself, dig my way up because I definitely would never find my way out of here uh. like I, at this point I don't think anybody would, I think it would just be sheer luck oh yeah? yeah so, but you know what time it is? what time is it? time to say goodbye no, Seagull. already? already Are you sure we can't go for another few minutes? Cause... yeah alright, we'll make it next time then so, we'll see you all next time. See you next time. And never stop Minecrafting. Never it's stop Minecraft. too much fun. Yes, Oops. it is. <laughs>
Bye. Okay. And we're back. And yes. you guys can hear that zombie is after me. And I do not know where he is. But there's that delicious looking gold and iron there. Oh, there's a creeper in the water. Hello, Mr. Creeper. So, our farm is coming along quite nicely. Is it? I haven't been up to see it. I, I know. think maybe after I collect this iron and take a, gold and take a look around here. Maybe it'll be time for me to come up. Yeah. I gotta find this zombie. Oh, two of them. Just trying to uh, throw some more torches up here and get things a little more lit up. Because uh, when I came back... To the, Ooh, uh, diamond! Diamond! Sweet! Yeah, it would be really nice if I could find enough diamond to make a diamond pickaxe. Because yeah. they last so much longer. Yeah. That's right, folks. Ooh, two diamond. Nice. We're rich. That's We're it, rich though. beyond belief. Not really. Not really. It's just fake. It's just fake stuff. It's but fun it's really fake, cool stuff, fake stuff, though. So I think sometime we should, uh, that, um, that map we're watching with, uh, Beef and Paws, uh, Ashes to Ashes, looks really interesting. Maybe we should do that sometime. Yeah? Yeah. I think that would be, uh... Oh, lag. Are you getting lag? No, I'm not getting lag. Oh, there's a couple of creepers hanging out by the window. So oh, I'll gosh. Have... You okay? You okay? You still yeah. there? Yep, I'm still here. All right, I was I getting... I got worried about you. I was getting attacked by two zombies and I think it might be time to go. Yeah. I think I'm going to oh, all right, of course. Of course, of course. I have one arrow. And I think I'm going to make myself a bow because I have enough wooden string and see if I remember the recipe for it oh. I have uh, appetizers for you spider eyes? yep Yum. <laughs> so I'm digging my way up what level are you at? I'm at <sighs> E1 I have a long ways to go <laughs> where are you at? 23 Oh, and I got some zombie flesh for you. Oh my gosh, I think I have a whole stack of zombie flesh. Nope, just 13. You and eating mob drops. Never understand it. They're delicious. <laughs> and they're free. Delicious and free. Oh. What? Q does not do anything. I keep pushing the wrong, wrong button. I'm harvesting dirt out of our flat. Because I needed three pair of creeper blasts. So what I'm doing, for those of you that may wonder, is I'm digging straight up. Uh, 
um, which will help bring me right up to the top without having to search around and yeah except once you get to the surface you're just gonna have to look around and yeah but it I don't think I'm that far from you what do you I'm at 27 392 oh, um, I'm at 31 and 216 yeah I'm not that far from where you are no and, and it's a lot faster to do this. Um, F2 takes a screenshot. Yep. Did not know that. Now you do. Yep. Oh, it's amazing the, the things you learn. <laughs> when you're done with me, you won't be a noob anymore. No, babe. You'll teach me everything, right? Mm-hmm. Teach you everything I know. Oh. oh About Minecraft. Fun. Oh, oh, okay. This is a, a family show. I thought you were talking about auto mechanics. What were you talking about? Cooking. Oh, cooking. Yeah. Well, I'll have to get an apron if you're going to teach me about cooking. Yeah. So. Oh. Your sister keeps telling me she's going to make me an apron. Does she? <laughs> oh, she teases me about it every once in a while. She's like, I'm going to make you an apron. Okay. <sighs> what more when I'm showing off my house husband skills? Is it daytime yet? No, it's not daytime. It needs to be daytime. I have work to do outside. And every time I try and work at night, we, uh, I end up fighting mobs and getting a creeper to blow stuff up. And there is a creeper right outside the cave entrance. Oh, nope, that's a zombie. I can fight zombies, they're not too bad. Definitely got spiders overhead. I can hear the pitter patter of their little feet. Oh, that's so creepy. Yeah. Where do you go? Where do you go? So I wonder what level I'm on. Fighting two spiders at once. 47? Yeah, I do. And you're on what, 60? I don't know, 61, I think. Took on two spiders at once. And I lost the zombie. Not sure he probably he got went. distracted. Probably. Definitely need oh, the stupid mouse wheel. Oh. Yeah, this mouse wheel isn't very good either, so. Oh, there's the zombie. He's just swimming in the lake. You know? So, I know what I can do. It's almost daytime, but I'm going to go in and make a few torches. Because I just used the last of mine. Whee! So, where are you at? Um, level 56. Talking? I'm concentrating on digging. And you were talking. Yes. I'm on level 56. Okay. So, I'm coming. I'm getting there. Yeah. It's complicated. You can't dig straight up. Because if you do, you're likely to get gravel to the face. Yep. And I've yep. taken a few chances, but... Never dig straight up, never dig straight down. So we haven't died in a while. I know, but I was just thinking we haven't died this episode. Or I any know. of these episodes that we've been doing. Yeah. It's, uh, it's kind of nice to uh, actually be able to survive a little bit. 
you get a get a little bit of shelter and there you go good job mr. zombie you caught yourself on fire I must be close to you because I can hear pigs yeah probably but I dug into an open area uh -huh. and there was a skeleton right there and I was like oh hello and he started shooting at me yeah yeah that wasn't very friendly of him no they're not very welcoming I'm on level 65 what level are you on? 65 so I must be you must oh. be in the hill yeah is it daytime? yes it's daytime I know it's dark. It takes so much dirt to fill in uh, <laughs> creeper holes. Now after... I'm expecting to see... Oh, there it is. Daylight! Yay! So yeah. where'd you come out? I don't know. I'm not out yet. Oh, okay. I'm under a tree. Oh, okay. Well, that's good. That means you didn't end up. I don't place. know where I came out. I can see a snow biome. All right, hang on. Let me. I can see. Oh, I'm right on a snow biome. I can see. Nothing. You can see nothing. A pig. Uh, I. Let's see. I'm trying to. I tried to get up high. Yeah. So see if I could see you. So you're definitely not near the desert. Hmm. Um, well, worst case scenario, I can use. Uh, I'm moving away from you because you're like 20. Uh, I'm being chased by a creeper. Get out of here, Mr. Creeper. It's raining. And it's getting very dark out. Yep. Um, so what are you... Nope, that's up. You're like 20... What's your Z? Um, hang on, I'm up on top of a hill. I'm trying to look for you. Let me, um... See if so I for my viewers who are wondering, if you look at these numbers up in the left-hand corner of my screen, the Y is my elevation level, and then the X and the Z are on an axis, so to speak. And zero, 00 is very close to spawn. I went too far. He's at like, I think you said 226-ish? Well, my Z right at the cave entrance for the is um, 1.2 for X, and Z One. is 197. Okay. Oh, I'm here! I'm here! Right. I'm at the pumpkin farm. Yeah, where are you? I don't see you. Turn around. Hi! Welcome back. <laughs> Whoops. <laughs> so. So it's pouring rain it's out. It's pouring rain. I'm going to put this iron up to smelt. Okay. I, uh, I have a gift Ooh. for you in there. Do you? It's not a creeper, is it? No, it's not a creeper. I've had my fair share of creepers. Yeah. Oh, we have almost two full stacks of iron. See? I'm Now you have a double stack oven. We do. So that you can be a good wife and stay home. And Now we have three ovens. You can make me cookies. You can make your own cookies. <laughs> you don't... In <laughs> Minecraft, you don't need an oven to make cookies. I know. But. 
So we have two stacks of redstone. Not that that's very useful. We have no, four no. diamonds. Five flint. What we really need are feathers. Yeah, I know. I think we're going to call it a day. Okay. We're going to end this episode. It's a I little bit shorter, I think, than the others, but not much. Well, um, do we want to spend a couple minutes outside looking at what I did? Oh, yeah. Definitely. So. What you did. Should Do we want to try and sleep the rain off? Is it nighttime? Uh, I don't know. Let's try. We have redstone now, so we can make a clock. No, nope, you can only sleep at night. And we have gold. Gold? I think you use gold to make a clock. Yeah. So, follow me. Hang on, I'm going to make a clock. Okay. So that we know what time it is. I'll make you one, too. Oh, that's so sweet. Where's the crafting bench? Oh, there it is. Right where you left it. Nope. I did that wrong. Alright. I'm up. So by the that's clock. how you make a clock, folks. Four gold and a redstone in the middle. Kind of expensive. But really worth it when you think how much use a clock is. It's almost night time. Do you want to come in? Yeah. I will head on in. They've changed the animation to the way items look when they're floating in front of you. And I just love it. I really do. It looks so cool. Yeah, I haven't played it enough to really remember the old way. Here you go. Aww. Hey, I got a clock. Can now I'll never sleep be late. At night. Oh no, it's like just past noon. Yeah. Oh, let's go back out. I was hoping to sleep the rain off. Yeah, I know. So. Um. Another useful thing to make now that we have some iron and some gold would, uh -huh. would be a map. Yeah. So, so this is the pumpkin farm. I gotta improve the stairs getting in and out of here. Another one of my projects I have to work on. Oh. Our so wheat farm. Yeah. Oh, there I'm you right are. behind you. So, this is all our wheat growing along here. Mm hmm. And then we have a break, and this is uh, carrots. No, this is potatoes. Uh, and then another break, and then these are carrots. Nice! So, um, as I harvest these and get more, I'll just keep expanding it. And, um, and that's our, our former mud hut is now the barn. And that's the remnants of a creeper hole. I've been filling it in a bunch. We have our first cow. And I've been trying to get a second cow but because I keep fighting creepers and uh, getting blown up I uh, have to uh, I haven't made it back hi mr. cow he's a nice cow she she's a nice cow Gertrude yeah I think we'll name her Gertrude what do you so, think that sounds that's like a good cow name a strange name a strange name what should we <laughs> name her then we should name her. Cow. Cow. Sounds like I don't get attached to them. Sounds sounds like a John Wayne movie. Does it? Yeah, in uh, one of John Wayne's movies, he had a, a dog, and he just called it Dog. Oh. A dog come. So, well, I'm going to run back home. I'm going to go to bed. All right. And, and I... we're going to call it an episode. All right. Sounds good. So... Thank you for spending your time with us. Thank you yes. for coming to play. Thank you. And never stop Minecrafting. It's too much fun. Yes, never stop Minecrafting. Where are you? There you are. Bye! Yeah.